Hi, I'm Susan Herter, a technology coordinator from Mounds U, Minnesota, and today I'm going to show you how to add students to your class along with guardians. There are two ways to add students to your class. One is by using the class code. You can find the class code right in your banner here. If you'd like to display it because students are sitting in your class, you can click on this square that will display it in a larger format, or if you need to go full screen, you can click on the additional square and really make it nice and bright for your students. When your students go to join, they'll click on this plus sign on the home page for Google Classroom, select join class, and enter the code here. You can also add students by inviting them to join your class. To do that, you go to the, your people tab. This is where you'll find teachers, co-teachers, and students. Select the little person with the plus, and you can add an email address here. If your district has on directory sharing, the address may pop up automatically. If not, you can just type the whole thing in here. You'll notice I now have a recipient. I select the recipient. At this point, I could add another student if I had multiple students. And I'm going to select invite. You'll notice here, my student is listed along with invited in parentheses. When the student accepts the invitation, which will show up on their class page as an invitation to join their class, this invited will disappear and the student will be listed as a student in your class. Once your student has accepted the invitation to join your class, you may want to add a parent or guardian to receive updates daily or weekly. In order to do that, I'm going to go to a class that has students enrolled already. And you'll see here I have an option to invite guardians. You may see a guardian email address already here if another teacher with the same student has already invited them to join. So again, I'm going to click invite guardians and add the address here. And again, select the recipient. If the student has more than one guardian, you can go ahead and add an additional one now. And select invite. And what I'll see here is invited in parentheses. When the parent accepts the invitation, both the teacher and the student receive an email saying that that invitation has been accepted. I hope this helps get your classroom populated with students and helps keep parents and guardians informed of what's going on in your classroom. Thanks for watching.